just stand firm because at the end of the day we're supporting the children, we're not supporting ourselves, we're supporting the children. Uh, as long as we know we're doing a good job and we're doing the right things and saying the right things, then you just, you just go with it. The social workers don't agree or they think we're not making ourselves available for them. You know, you've got to make a consultation with them, but they're not always agreeable. You know, uh, but at the end of the day, we're looking after the children, but they're the corporate parents, and that's the problem. So you just take a bit of power away, power away from them. If they say jump, sometimes you feel you've got to jump. Yeah, that's yeah. so hard though. Yeah, and I've, all, I, I've come from an office job where I manage my own workload. Uh, I've had my own business, and then you come into a situation where you kind of you've not got any control really. Uh, yeah, and it's, it's, that's not easy because mm. I thought that the, the communication would be better. Yeah. Mm. You know, but we've got reasonable relationships with the social workers. We don't, we're not falling out with them. We, we you know, they they've got their own workload as well, and their own difficulties that under, understaffed. But at the end of the day, as long as we do what's right for the children, and we try and support them as best we can. Yeah, Sometimes it's not always enough, no. you know, because uh, you know there could be more that could be done by by the uh, the service. But you know, it is what it is. We just keep doing what we're doing, and, and hope that it'll make a difference at the end of the day. Most difficult thing about it is, I suppose it's you have less freedom. And less freedom of, 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 I suppose, the decisions around the children to help them. We can only do so much, but there's so much more that, that needs to be done. And most of the time it's not being done, and it's difficult. It's going to be banging your head against a brick wall. Uh, and that's the hardest thing. When you come from a situation where you've always been able to control what you do and have an influence on what you do, and I've had my own business and then I've done this, it's like that you've got to do that. And get just get on with it. That's the hardest part, not the communication.